Now, the red hair, she ain't having no abortions, man. Every baby's coming alive. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care who the baby with. They come, they come to earth. <laughs> All right, now, in your opinion, mm -hmm. who most likely to bust out your car windows in this picture? Mm, this red hair or green hair? I'm gonna say red. But I think the most person, the, the person that's more dangerous is somebody with green hair. Just because somebody with green hair, I think red is more natural. It's more accepted now in society than green. Brandon, is you crazy, Brandon? Which one do you see more of? I, if I go to a fast food place right now, somebody going to have red hair. And they be fighting. You see the videos at Popeye's. They be right. fighting. But that, but that person is more acceptable. I think the person, so you think the person with green hair is safe? Nah, I think now, see, like I said before, the green hair, that means if you brush across the shoulder, mm -hmm. a sexual harassment charge is going to be coming up pretty <laughs> <laughs> A sexual harassment charge is going to be coming up pretty soon. So you say the red oh. is fiery, but the, the no. green is still dangerous, too. No, no. The watch is now. The red hair, she ain't having no abortions, man. Every baby's coming alive. <laughs> I don't care who the baby with. They come, they come to earth. <laughs> Green hair. Uh, if if she ain't gonna benefit off that baby, that baby gone, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> brother, hmm? brother, the consumer said both. Both are dangerous. That's funny. But well, actually, at Mr. Uh, uh, brother works a consumer. Who will bust out your windows most likely? <laughs> Red. <laughs> <laughs> no, but Red watch this. Sure. Watch this. I don't want my mom to hear this. No. <laughs> Who will be the best in the bed, Brandon? Red. Oh, why is that? I can't say you. We we both can't really talk this this episode, <laughs> <laughs> huh? Who will be the best? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go off of color. Just red. I'm just say red. All right. Now you getting a jump outside the <laughs> kangaroo gas station. <laughs> <laughs> you, no, wait, wait, well, let me finish now. Okay, go ahead. You get a jump outside of kangaroo gas <laughs> You get a jump outside of kangaroo gas station. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Which 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 person? Huh? I'm good. Yeah. My daughter told me I'm not good. <laughs> which person go call most likely to call the cops? Hmm? Oh, I didn't say bread help me, but go ahead, go ahead. What you say? I'm sorry, if, Lewis. If you get jumped out the kangaroo at the kangaroo <laughs> gas station, <laughs> which which one could be most likely to call the cops for help? Mm, green. Okay. All right. If you get jumped at the kangaroo <laughs> gas station, which would be the most most likely to jump in the fight? Red. All if, right, I'm, when, if I'm with red, I'm gonna be in a fight. If I'm with green, I'm not gonna have an issue. But if it's a fight, if a fight has already started, <laughs> red is gonna definitely help. Green is gonna run. Green may may flee. So I'm yeah. betting on red. I'm betting on red. Now I tell you, um, if the, <laughs> let me shut up. I ain't gonna say that. <laughs> but That's ladies, funny. you see how the outside appearance and guys, the outside right. appearance can change how a person view you. That's right. Like every time I see this, this will come to mind. And you know? the same thing goes for us too. Like, like if I see Lewis with a short haircut and I see somebody like me with locks, I'm I'm judging two different ways. That's just how we are. You're right. I get hired for a job from a white man before Brandy get hired for a job. <laughs> right. Brandy can have a a master degree, <laughs> ten years right, of experience, correct. and I have not know that I get hired for him. Right. There are a lot of issues that's facing the black community, from relationships between mother and father, and the failure of passing down standards, integrity, and duty, from the lack of education, or the debt load from higher education. Go to school, they say, but no opportunity on graduation day. From incarceration to low-skill occupation that marches in gentrification. Well, 
The time has come. It's time for a change. My book, From Zero to 200K, will outline the steps I use to change my social and economical status. Learn the steps I took to lower my expenses. Learn the steps I took to increase my income. Learn the steps I took to increase my credit and keep a good credit score. Learn about how I generate wealth. Most importantly, how I got God involved in my life. By the time you finish this book, you'll be ready to control your finances with a renewed vigor, knowing that you can accomplish your goals if you apply yourself and make good decisions over the long term. From zero to 200K, with faith, relationships, strippers, jobs, college, hustles, and heartbreak taught me about finance. It's a must read for every black person in America. Hit the link below and let's get to work.